गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू स्टार्ट योर न्यू चैप्टर चैप्टर नंबर टू दैट इज मोशन सो इन दिस चैप्टर फर्स्ट वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट मोशन एंड आफ्टर दैट वी विल लर्न अबाउट रेस्ट सो इन आवर डे टू डे लाइफ वी सी वेरियस ऑब्जेक्ट दैट चेंज इट्स पोजिशन with respect to time as well as with the stationary object compared to the stationary object that means we have seen various thing like a bird flying in the sky a car moving on the road a train moving on the railway track so these are the object that change its position with respect to time as well as it changes its position with respect to the stationary object that means what is motion a body is said to be in motion when it changes its position with respect to time as well as with respect to some stationary object A stationary object means the object that does not change its position, remain at, remain fixed at a constant place. That means that do not change their position with respect to time. That is called a stationary object. So, what is motion? A body is said to be in motion when it changes its position with time. and with respect to a stationary object that means see we have seen many example like the blade of the fan we have seen fan the blade of the fan changes its position with respect to time that means the blade of the fan is in motion with respect to time why because the position of blade changes with respect to time as well as respect to the stationary object okay so motion is what a motion means that a body when a body changes its position with respect to time as well as with respect to some stationary object then the body is said to be in motion see the earth rotate on its axis that means the rotation of earth is also an example of what motion because its position changes as the time passes by so these are the main example of motion now the next topic is rest what is rest we have seen different things like a duster lying on the table a boy sitting on a chair that means their position is not changes with respect to time so a body is said to be in rest when its position does not changes with respect to time as well as respect to the some stationary object so what is rest a body is said to be at rest when it does not changes its position with time and with respect to other fixed bodies fixed body means the bodies which is nearby that means with respect to that bodies his or her position is not changes with respect to time or respect to some other object that means the body is said to be at rest so what is difference between what is the main difference between rest and motion the only difference is that in motion the body changes its position with respect to time but in case of rest the body does not changes its position with respect to time as well as with respect to some other stationary object so we have seen different example a boy running in the field a boy uh, doing jogging in the field so these are the example of what these are the example of motion 
Why these are the example of motion? Because their position changes with respect to time. So this is called what motion. And in the same way, when the body does not changes its position with respect to time, that is called rest. Hope you all have understood about rest and motion. So homework is to learn about rest and motion. Thank you.